of the bike now features the combined analog digital instrument console. It features two circular dials with chrome surrounded rings. The left dial has an analog speedometer while it also has a blue colored LCD for its digital odometer, two trip meter, clock and fuel gauge. The right dial of this bike has an analog tachometer and all essential LED indicators. retains its twin spark 346 cubic centimeters engine it's a single cylinder four stroke engine which produces the peak power of 19.8 bhp at 5250 rpm the maximum torque output of this air cooled engine is of 28 nm which arrives at 4000 rpm this engine is mated with a five speed manual gearbox it has one gear down and Park gears, upshift pattern, this engine feels well composed and supplies adequate power at low RPM. The thumping sound of this bike is a bit different. Don, before though, Royal Enfield has kept its gear ratios short. The gearbox of this bike is quite smooth and comes with well spaced gear ratios. The key quality of this engine is that it never feels strained, even after two hours of driving. The bike offers a high seating, riding posture with upraised handlebar. This handlebar allows you to stay in a relaxed position and also offers you a firm palm grip. Its new seat is quite comfortable as it's padded with high quality of fabrics. The rear rider also gets optimum comfort through rubber backrest, which is quite useful on long journeys. Thunderbird has front set foot pegs, which enables you to stretch your legs comfortably. appearance gets enhanced by the chrome finished side indicators and instrument console Thunderbird now comes with a compact front fender which gels well with the multi-spoke rim of this bike when you move to the side of this bike you will notice new upgradations like new paint finish for its fuel tank and side panels also comes with new stylish LED tail light Thank you.
for watching. Stay updated to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Always go with your passion. Enjoy your day.